Good morning, good morning, good morning. Today's devotion of uh, scripture is coming from the 85th number of Psalms, and I began reading at verse 9 and conclude with 13. Surely his salvation is nigh them that fear him, that glory may dwell in our land. Mercy and truth are met together. Righteous and peace have kissed each other. Truth shall bring out of the earth, and righteousness shall look down from heaven. Yea, the Lord shall give that which is good, and our land will yield her increase. Righteousness shall go before him, and shall set up in the way of his steps. The word of God for the people of God. Today's scripture is another look at finding God in the psalm. And as we see here, he is in here because verse 9 says, Surely his salvation is nigh to them that fear him. Yes, all who reverence God with the fear of reverence, his salvation is near. And our faith comes uh that salvation is guaranteed by our faith and acceptance of Jesus Christ as our Lord and Savior. Then we see verse nine, uh, 10 talks about God's mercy and his truth. As he is merciful, he is righteous, and he is the truth. And truth always wins, always brings about good. And... Uh, it talks about when we are truth and God's truth is prevailing in the earth, it will show itself throughout all the land. And his righteousness and him and his righteousness is looking down from heaven upon his people who are walking in his ways and his statutes as we are the sons and daughters of a righteous God. And he says in the verse 9, Righteousness shall go before him and shall set, up, set us up in the way of his steps because of, of our devotion, our de uh, con commitment, and being a child of God, we do walk in his righteousness and his ways, as, as I said earlier, and are devoted to him and serving him in a fear of reverence. May God bless you and have a blessed day.